Hello friends, here we have 3 raised to x plus y is equal to square root of 27 and 3 raised to x minus y is equal to square root of 27. Let's find out x and y. We will call this is equation number 1 and this is equation number 2. And let's take equation number 1 which is 3 raised to x plus y is equal to square root of 27. We will focus on right hand side and it can be written as square root of 9 times 3. So we can also write it like square root of 9 into square root of 3. Square root of 9 is 3 times square root of 3 can be written as 3 raised to 1 upon 2. And here 1 is default exponent. Now let me remind this rule where a raised to b into a raised to c then it can be written as a raised to b plus c. So here we can write it like 3 raised to 1 plus 1 upon 2. 1 plus 1 upon 2 is equal to 2 plus 1 upon 2 is equal to 3 upon 2. So here we can write 3 raised to 3 upon 2. Now let's write the whole equation. 3 raised to x plus y is equal to 3 raised to 3 upon 2. This equation has same base so their exponents can be equated. So x plus y is equal to 3 upon 2. And let's call this equation 3. Now let's take equation 2 which is 3 raised to x minus y is equal to square root of 27. This is equation 2. And we can operate the right hand side in same manner like in the equation 1. So let's write it directly. 3 raised to x minus y is equal to 3 raised to 3 upon 2. Now again we can equate the exponent x minus y is equal to 3 upon 2 and let's call this equation 4. Now we will add equation 3 and 4. So x plus y is equal to 3 upon 2 plus x minus y is equal to 3 upon 2. Let's add them this plus y and minus y get cancelled out and here we have 2x is equal to 3 upon 2 plus 3 upon 2. So we have 2x is equal to 3 plus 3 upon 2. So it can be written as 2x is equal to 6 upon 2. So we have 2x is equal to 3. So x is equal to 3 upon 2. Now we have the value of x and let's put this value of x in either third or fourth equation. Let's take third equation which is x plus y is equal to 3 upon 2. Putting 3 upon 2 in place of x. So we have 3 upon 2 plus y is equal to 3 upon 2. So y is equal to 3 upon 2 minus 3 upon 2. So y is equal to 0. So the answers are x is equal to 3 upon 2 and y is equal to 0. That's it. I hope you have enjoyed this learning. For more learnings, please subscribe. Bye-bye.